Hi guys, this is Catherine, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm going to show you how to boost your FPS in World of Warcraft. So first of all, we'll make sure that your Windows is properly optimized. So the first thing that you need to do is write game mode here. Make sure that your game mode is at off, really important. And also make sure your game bar is at off. The second thing that you need to do, uh, I'm using this software, Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. Uh, this software will purge your uh, standby list automatically. Um, so because Windows have a lot of issue with that. And if you have less than 16 gig of RAM, I definitely recommend this software. I will put the link in my uh, video description and you can download it. The other thing that you need to do, it's in the launcher. So first of all, click option here, uh, game settings. And in streaming, make sure that enable streaming is unchecked. Really important. Click done. After that, uh, we will go inside of the file on the folder World of Warcraft. So you need to press show in Explorer. You will see the area that you have World of Warcraft. Double click on it. Click uh, retail. In the executable, so the .exe, this one, the wow thing. Right click on it, properties, go to compatibility, make sure that disable full screen optimization is checked and also make sure that override IDPI is checked. Double click on it. The other thing that you need, you can do, it's in the WTF document here, the config file, right click on it. You can use notepad plus plus, open it. And here you have all your settings inside of the game. So if you want to change and tweak I don't know, density, opacity, stuff like that. Everything is there and you see numbers so you can lower it to gain more FPS or you can uh, put more numbers if you want, if you have a beast computer. So everything is there. So now we will go inside of the game and I will show you what to change uh, for low end and even mid range computer. And uh, yeah, let's go for it. Hi everybody, this is Catherine, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm gonna show you how to boost your FPS in um, World of Warcraft. So first of all, uh, we will start with the graphic parameter, um, the display mode. I'm playing full screen for sure, like pretty much everybody. Uh, for the resolution, depending normally when you, what you're using. So uh, me, I'm playing 1080p. Uh, but after all the changes I will show you, if you still don't get your 60, you definitely should lower your resolution. Resol resolution scale, I'm playing one for one, so 100%. Don't go higher than that, you will lose a lot of FPS. And if you want to go lower, you can go at 95, but honestly, you will see a lot of blurriness and pixel. Uh, Anti-aliasing, remove completely this from the game. It will You will gain a nice 4 to 5% of boost. Uh, virtual vertical sync, I'm not using it. Uh, so let's start. Texture. If you have 4 gig and more, honestly, you can put everything at max, you will have no problem to run the game. If you have two gig and less, you can start to test with fair four hex air and enable project texture. And if you have less than two gig, go with low, put bilinear or trilinear and deactivate the project texture. Uh, after that, environment, this one is huge. View distance will gain, it will give you a lot of FPS or you will lose a lot of FPS with it. So really important to change it. Uh, go with treat, do you some testing. If you're uh, happy with your FPS, you can go a little bit higher or lower if you want more FPS. Uh, for each level here, you can gain one to two percent of FPS boost, so it's it's pretty important. Environment detail and cl uh, ground clutter. Put this one at uh, at one. You will gain another seven percent boost in your FPS. After that, shadow quality. Uh, really important. Put this one at low. Uh, ultra high to low, you can gain like 15% of FPS. It's pretty huge. Uh, liquid detail, detail, put this one at fair. Sun shaft, disable it. You will gain another 4% uh, percent of FPS. Uh, particle density, I'm using f fair. Honestly, between fair and low, you will not see a big difference in your FPS. So go with fair. It's a little bit better. Ambient occlusion, disable this one, another 4% here. Depth effect, same thing, another 4% if you disable it. And the outline mode, put this one at good. After that, press apply. After that, you can go in uh, the advanced setting. Uh, you don't want to use triple buffering, MSAA, multi sample, post process, everything should be disabled and none, really important. Uh, resample quality, use bill in there. 
The one that's really important here is the graphic API. If you have an old computer, like an old graphic card, use DirectX 11. Normally, you will have more FPS with DirectX, uh, DirectX 11, but honestly, test both of them. Look at your FPS, do some testing, walk in the game, etc., and you will see which one perform better. Uh, this one is really important. Uh, and the last thing is if you want to lock your FPS and stuff, you can change it here uh, because you're not using the vertical sync. I have a weird glitch right now. I don't know why my FPS, yeah, you see, <laughs> FPS went back. Anyway, so that's about it, guys. Uh, if you have any question, just comment in the YouTube section. Uh, post me your rig, CPU, GPU, and RAM. I will try to help you the best that I can. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Peace.